So have you ever felt like somebody who's really important to you forgot about you? Not a good feeling, is it? Hey friends, it's Pastor Mike from Fellowship Church. Always love to connect with you midweek. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a wonderful week and hope you've had a chance to be a part of our vacation Bible school this week. Going really well here, love it. That question for you again. Have you ever felt forgotten by somebody who was really important to you? There was a time back in the Old Testament of the Bible when the entire nation of Israel just felt forgotten. They were going through some very difficult times. They had suffered some significant losses, a lot of pain, a lot of confusion, a lot of disillusionment, a lot of who are we now? We thought God would always be there for us. And and so there were people saying, you know, God just forgot about us. He must have a lot of things on his mind and somehow he just forgot about us. So in the book of Isaiah, Isaiah 49, I think it is, God sends a message back to Israel and God says, I never forgot about you. He makes it very clear to them that they were always on his mind. The fact that they were going through a difficult time didn't mean that he forgot about them. And then God gave them a really clear illustration. God says, could a a mother forget her nursing baby? And then he says, I can't forget you. I engraved you on the palms of my hands. That's Isaiah 49, 16. Friends, that's an incredible image when you think about it. God saying, I couldn't forget about you because I literally engraved you on the palms of my hands. That word engraved means something a lot more than, well, I wrote you down on the palms of my hands because friends, if you've written something on your body sometime in the past, you know that if you put a little soap on it, you can wash it off. But engraving, that's something else all different. Some translations say, I've inscribed you on the palms of my hands. But what it means is that God says, you mattered so much to me that when I wanted to make sure I could never forget about you, I wrote you down, I put your names down in one of the places on my own body. Yes, God has a body. I wrote you down in one of the places of my body that I'm most common to look at. I mean, think about it, friends. What other parts of your body do you look at more often than, well, just the palms of your hands? So here's a really cool thought for you today. You may have times in your life when you're going through a difficult situation. Maybe you're facing some unexpected losses, pain. Maybe you're discouraged, disillusioned. And maybe, just maybe, you have a moment when you think to yourself, I think God just looked the other way. Or maybe God's off on vacation. Or maybe God just plain forgot about me. Well, here's a message from God to you. God says, I could never forget about you because I wrote you down on one of the most easy to see places in my body. You are literally on the palms of my hands. What that means, friends, is that every time God looks at the palms of his hands, he's thinking about you. What a cool thought. And just another thought for you here as well, connected to that. Do you remember what Jesus has on his hands? Yes, in the Gospels, after the crucifixion, Jesus talks about the fact that he still has wounds on his hands from the nails and the cross. That tells me that when Jesus looks at his hands today, who's he thinking about? Me? You? The wounds in his hands are left over from that crucifixion. He'd do it all over again just for you. Those wounds are a great reminder of you. So friends, don't ever think that God has forgotten about you. God went so far as to write you down, inscribed you on the palms of his hands so that you'd always be that close to his mind. God could never forget about you. He loves you far too much for that. I hope you have a wonderful week. Hope you're taking care of yourself. Know that we love you and we're praying for you. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye. Thank you.